Hello again YouTube, Enzo back bringing you another video and I hope some viewers will find this video helpful. Um, if you're having trouble with your KBB MP10 V from Kumbau, basically your Voyager sized uh, version of um, MP10 Prime, uh, hopefully this fix is uh, failed. Now the reason Prime is dismantled at the moment is because lately um, his hips have been incredibly, incredibly loose. Uh, can't get him again can't get him to stand up right at all and i was really worried about the ratchets and things like that so i decided to uh, take everything apart and have a really good route around to see exactly what was the problem and the problem was these little teeth inside you now you may these are quite similar to when i did the snd kit from after the when i had to put uh, um the legs back in now stuff like that well these are basically the same type of ratchets you could basically call them universal ratchets so uh, I noticed, uh, obviously, the worst leg of all was the left leg, which would have been this one on when you put it back on Prime. So um, having a good look at it, I noticed, and it was uh, because this is diecast, I noticed there was quite a bit of debris inside. So I've come up with um, an idea, and what I've actually done is I've uh, taken these pieces out like that, and if you can see that bit of plastic in there although it's kind of hard to really see because of its metal but i'll basically show you what i've, what I've done i've basically taken um, a cable tie and i've cut it to the to the correct length and i've you might be able to see it a little bit better now yeah there you are and i've packed the material in there now now it's still not sitting 100 percent flush so i'm going to try and just push that in just to get it a little bit flatter i may need to pull it out and trim it again now but uh, it looks all right and then we'll just take the ratchet piece and just slot that back in like so there we go now that's what i've tried to do because obviously this side was the worst now this side still looks a little bit higher than that um i've cleaned it as best i can got most of the debris but obviously this is die cast it's very very tough so obviously i've done the best i can but i've put one leg on at a time and I've put the waist back on. This isn't die cast, by the way, this is plastic. But I've put everything back on, and when I was moving the legs back and forth, what a fantastic noise. Nice clickety ratchets, very, very strong. So um, that's what I would recommend uh, for anybody who's having trouble with the hips, is basically to pack a bit of material um, in the back there. Not too much, just bring it out a little bit, so obviously the teeth have got something to grip on. Because these are... The ratchets that come with Prime. This is a start. This is what comes on uh, Prime's leg, and you can see there now. Well, I was worried that the teeth had worn away, but no. As you can see, all the teeth there are in really good condition. There's nothing wrong with them at all. A little bit greasy. I'm going to put a little bit of um, a little bit of grease on there as well, now, just to keep them lubricated a little bit now. And then obviously you just pop that, pop that back in there. It fits in the groove there. And then that's what. I hope you can hear that noise. But that's what you should be hearing. Now I wasn't I wasn't having anything like that with um, Prime's leg before I did the modification. I've done both sides, and then this one will be the same now for you. So didn't have any problems with this one. So fingers crossed. Now when I put everything back together, everything should be fine. Now this was the standard screw that came with the figure that I took out. As you can see, it's very very badly rounded off there, and I don't think it's long enough. To be perfectly honest though because obviously it fits into the back there it's got quite a bit of material to go through it's got to go into here as well and i don't think it was doing the job so i've actually found another screw it's a uh, little bit longer i think it's longer let's double check um maybe just a little bit well i would say no much difference in it at all but it is, it is a bit thicker so I'll be putting that in there. Actually, no. Do you know what I've done? I picked up the wrong screw. <laughs> it's upstairs in me somewhere. So anyway, sorry about that. But uh, there is. Did I bring another one down with me? Oh, don't tell me I've lost that now. Anyway, I've got a thicker screw upstairs. And once I put everything back together, I'll be putting that in there. And I might have to. I don't know if I'll ruin the thread inside here. But obviously, that little screw isn't doing the job because it was coming out. And what I was noticing as well. A lot of the times when I was posing the figure, the hips were were coming apart. That was coming apart, that was coming apart, and that's probably contributed to a lot of the loose play in the hips. So if you are having 
um, the same trouble as I've been experiencing with my figure, then try this fix for yourself. Just basically one screw, pop it out, separate the parts, just get yourself a cable tie or any kind of uh, material you feel comfortable in using, cut it to the correct length, pull these little ratchet pieces out, pack the material, put it on top, and obviously I what, what I done, just put one leg first, put it back in, make it nice and tight. Once you're happy with um, the noise or you think it's uh, good enough, then reassemble your figure and have a go. So that's what I'm going to be doing now. So obviously I'm not going to do it on camera because uh, <laughs> the last time I did the SND kit, yes, there was a lot of swearing and it took me ages. It's a very, very fiddly job. So I'm going to cut the camera and I'll do the, the quick um, fix now and then do another video once everything is... Um, I was only being completed. So again, thank you very much. Do you come out? Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Uh, please stick around for my other reviews. Um, there's a. I'll be also be posting a channel update uh, sometime today because I'm going away on holidays and just want to let uh, my regular subscribers and my new subscribers know exactly what's going on. Okay then, I shall see you in a little while. Thank you. Tada.